Track at Grafton a couple days before it starts. We're dropping off the truck hitches. Saturday night, August 26, 2023 at Grafton, West Virginia. You park in the field and then you walk up to the ticket booth. Admission is $20 for adults. Kids 11 and under are free. We can pass $30. This is the pit area for the pullers. They're getting the track ready for the first pulls of the night. Paul found Dale Malinzak on the golf cart. Hillside seating. Pullers checking the track out. Big Red the roller. And here comes another roller. Everybody's waiting for things to start. Here comes the pulling sled. Firemen are getting in position and waiting. Did I tell you that it's hot tonight? A colorful orange sled. It says, you know we're going to get ya. Justin's getting a ride to the other end of the track. This is his stop. Time to get off. More firemen have gathered.
We've crossed to the other side of the track, to the spectator side. You can bring lawn chairs for seating or sit in one of the stands. We're going up on the hill to where the food trucks and concessions are. This one is Leonard's Grill. They have funnel cakes and lemonade. Look at the view on the back side of the concession. A great variety of food choices. Lots of people. It says Wonder Bubble. This stand is the Mount Pleasant United Methodist Church. A lot of choices at this food trailer. This trailer is Big Bubba's Pit Stop. I didn't know there was a back entrance. I like the view. A very colorful trailer. We chose to eat Rex's calzones. Loaded with everything. They were deep fried. Then we got some water. Tie-dye shirts and aliens. Face painting. Popcorn and t-shirts. View from the hill at the concession stands. Smoke trail. Now that we've ate, it's time to get back to the track. Sponsor signs along the track. You can see some of the semis parked. Paul getting some 50-50 tickets. Black smoke from another pool. They groom the track after each pool. Some of the semis waiting to pull. Semi hitches. The beginning of the track. Drivers catching up with each other as they wait. Sunset. And that's your truck behind you? Nick Lockery, full truck called Moose's Mud. Nick Lockery, full truck owned by Chase Trucking called Moose's Mud. Mom, picture. Let's go. Cody Record and his family. The outlaw kids. Shannon, I'm 
people and the streets in my class and the truck I call race truck. Adding more weight to the sled. As the horsepower goes up, a truck tow hitch and a truck pull hitch. Josh Yost and Nicole the Killer Mac. This is Josh Yost and his Killer Mac. His truck is amazing. He's very talented. A truck with a lot of history and he's keeping it alive. This is Tom Brown Jr. I pull a Mac Supermodern and a 3.6 Pro Street. This is the truck Tom Brown Jr. drives. Tom Brown Trucking, Bulldog Mafia, Clouds of Smoke. This is Dale Malenzak's truck, Big Mo. My name is Dale and I drive Big Mo. <laughs> the moon above. And what class do you pull in? Does your truck have a name? And this is his truck. Strikingly unique truck. The Bighorn. He traveled here from New York. An eye catcher. Cody Record pulling in to get weighed. Starting to get darker. Mike Adams getting weighed. Placing portable scales under the tires. Now he backs up onto the portable scales. Demetrius Bischoff pulling in to get weighed also. Nice looking cab over. Both of them. Farm tractors are pulling tonight too. Nick Lockery with Moose's Mutt for weigh-in. Semis everywhere, waiting to get weighed. Placing the scales under the truck. There goes Nolan Marple to get weighed. Lots of smoke in the air tonight.
I got motor. I asked Moose if you were coming up. Right. He said he thought.
The pulling is all done, and now it's time to get packed up to go home. A lot of these drivers and pullers have a long way to go to go home. It makes for long evenings sometimes. The track is very silent right now. The stands are empty. The semi is hooking up to the pull sled to get it ready. All around the track, cleanup has begun, gathering garbage and signs and light plants. They are getting the truck hitches loaded onto the trailer. They're heading out and heading home. The memory card filled up just as I was filming Joe Gambino from Springville, New York. He was pulling in the 4.1 class. A big thank you to the three video contributors that let me use their videos. The nights was a long video, but there was a lot to see. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Tap the bell to get notified. Like and share.